And we know the pandemic forced us to really press pause on so many things we take for granted. But for a Gaston County couple, they had to put their whole family on hold until recently. Justin and Rebecca Kirkland live on farmland in Gastonia with plenty of room for their goats, chickens and pigs. And as of last week, five kids. This is Alyssa. This is Gay. This is Samuel Kirkland. He's our shy one. This is Abigail. And this is Vinny. According to their grandmother, three of the siblings were living in a tent in someone's backyard when Department of Social Services placed them in the foster care system. That was just about the time the Kirklands became a licensed foster home. In August 6th of 2018, we were placed um, with our, the, our first placement. Um, and it was Benny, Gabe, and Alyssa, and they have been here ever since. A turn of events, considering Justin's position at one point. And I had doubts. I had some <laughs> doubts. But, uh, Justin, at one point before we were married, just as we weren't dating at the time, he said he never wanted, he didn't want to have children. But the faith-based couple felt a higher calling. I created you to help. So that's when God put it on my burden on my heart to help others. And this is the best way that we could help mm -hmm. kids. The challenge then was everyone's challenge, COVID. So everything was pushed out. Um, so, um, but we would have adopted from day one. It just took three and a half years to get to that place to where we could adopt. They signed the adoption papers last Sunday. The only thing that changed that day was last names and, you know, birth certificates and things like that. But, um, you know, they've always been a part of our hearts and our home. And said from the mouth of babes. And Alyssa said, well, I'm already a Kirkland. So cute. Well, if you're considering opening up your homes and hearts to kids in need, the Gaston County Department of Health and Human Services says there is a great need for foster parents, especially for teens and sibling groups. The agency is going to host a recruitment event for those interested in becoming foster care parents. It'll be held Saturday, April 23rd from 10 a.m. until 1 at Dallas Park. There will be food, music and games and people can talk to current, even former foster parents about their experience.